Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Boy out of my boots, huh? Hop on the whip and go room. Nigga thought down I go boom. I won't even break a sweat. I'm gonna just call my Okay guys, so as you can see, you know, I just woke up. It's like 8.15. I set an alarm to wake up early. I went to bed late, so that doesn't really work out. Today we have a hair video. Um, if we're being honest, I haven't washed my hair in like a week. So last week I stopped at Walmart. That sounds like I drive on my own. I went to the store with my mom and I picked up some hair products while I was there because I am so done with twist outs. Like I see people commenting on my twist out videos all the time. Does she do this every night? Like how often do you do this? And I'm like sis you right way too much so we need to try out these natural curls it's summer my hair's been getting a lot healthier ever since i killed it whenever i dyed it like five times honestly we're just not gonna talk about that <laughs> no 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 <laughs> <laughs> so at the store I picked up a few things and we're gonna see if this works okay I'm excited so the first thing I got let's just start with like the most boring thing this is just a leave-in conditioner it's by Garnier it's their coconut oil and coconut butter one so I know this is super basic and like you're probably thinking why not Cantu or Shea Moisture I have both Cantu and Shea I have both Cantu and Shea Moisture. A lot of the products that are made for natural hair are just super heavy in my hair and extremely oily. Like Shea Moisture and Cantu make my hair super greasy and I want this wash and go to be really fluffy. So I decided to just get something that's a lot lighter and it's not really dense and it's not really made for like natural hair only, you know? So yeah, we're gonna try this out. So the next thing we're gonna try, I got this at Target. I've been looking for this and then I thought, you know, they probably only have it at Target and they have the whole line at Target. So I had to get this. This is the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Curls Deep Conditioner. I've been wanting to try their curly line for a while now. So I'm really excited to try this. The next thing I have is the Renewing Argan Oil. And I thought this would help kind of just get rid of any crunch that my hair might have as it's drying. Because I don't like crunchy wash and goes. I just want it to be fluffy. And it's really hard to find the right products for that. So I thought maybe this would help. So then the last thing I got. I thought this would be perfect to get soft fluffy curls. This is... Jelly Soft Curls by Miss Jessie's. Hopefully this does what it says. It says, for people who want popping curls without the crunch. So actually, what I plan on doing, I'm gonna wash my hair with shampoo and conditioner in the shower. Once I'm done deep conditioning, shampooing, and conditioning my hair, all that type of stuff, I'm gonna put the products in my hair before I get out of the shower. I just think this is gonna work better for my hair because I want my fluffy curls. And whenever I try wash and go and I just get out of the shower and I put the products in my hair after I get out, my hair just gets so weighed down and I don't like it. It, but I love my curls after I get out of the shower and I put my microfiber towel on and then I take it out and they're like huge and I'm like yes so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put all the products in my hair before I get out of the shower then I'm gonna put the microfiber towel on for a little bit we're not gonna take out all the product so I need to stop talking this is probably getting really boring I hate long intros and I just skip past them you probably already did the same to this and I'm probably just wasting my time so um let's go ahead and get started you know I really should have focused the camera before I um, got the bathroom floor all wet. Like now I'm gonna have some like dry feet on this wet bathtub. Like, turn this until it looks clear on me. Which okay. one? This one? Nope. This one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll be turned sideways. Okay. <laughs> Okay, sis, we are in new territory. I'm gonna shave my armpits for you guys because sis has been growing it out, you know? I'll be right back. First, we're gonna take out the millions of bobby pins. I should have put a towel down because I'm gonna ruin this little rug. That's it. Okay, my hair is, there's gonna be so many knots. Like, don't judge me, my hair is never this knotty. But since I haven't washed my hair in like a week, not today. Holy crap. Oh. We're gonna get my hair wet. Bring this out here. Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna do is this root rinse, which I didn't talk about in the beginning because I was gonna save it when I actually get in the shower. This is the Cantu Shea Butter Apple Cider Vinegar Root Rinse. It says it's a gentle scalp detox. This basically cleans your scalp and gets rid of all the buildup, which is what I need since I haven't washed my hair in like a year. So it makes your scalp feel so good. So basically just literally you go like this. It's really good for like braids and stuff, but we need it right now. I definitely recommend this. It's super cheap, but it works great.
All right, I never even used that much, but it was much needed today. And then you can just rinse it out. It also feels like it kind of moisturizes, which is good because my hair feels like fine straw right now. Well, I mean, now we don't really have to go in with conditioner because that kind of got all the build up off my scalp, which is the only reason I use shampoo. So we're gonna go ahead in with the intensive repair, deep treatment, exactly what I need. Wait. We're gonna do the regular conditioner first. No, I'll do that after. So this is the Cantu Shea Butter Intensive Repair Deep Treatment Mask. This works so well, like. Make sure you get under. Make sure to also get your ends. That's what I'm gonna do next because the ends of your hair are the oldest part of your hair. Like, those are the seniors, so. So, I'm just putting this through my hair. And as we let this sit, I'm just gonna like maybe shave actually. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna shave my legs and my arms. Yes, I shaved my arms. No, it doesn't grow back thicker. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I just realized I'm probably going to get a whole bunch of comments on wasting water. Um, it's definitely been long enough to rinse this out. This is why we're going to do another deep conditioner because my hair is going to be like still dying for hydration. I actually don't need the water on right now. You hear that? As I was talking about Cantu products earlier, how they can be really heavy. This is just a mask, so I am gonna wash it out, so it's fine. I'm not saying Cantu is bad or anything. They're great. I love their twist and lock gel and everything. Just, if I'm gonna do a wash and go, I'd rather not. Half my head? Yes, please. It's probably not even recording. So once the hair treatment has been sitting in my hair for a while, it says on the back how long, I think it's, this has been in my hair for like 10 minutes. And I got all the knots out of my hair. We're going to rinse it out. So once that's rinsed out, we're going to put in our Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Curls Deep Conditioner. I haven't used this yet, but this isn't going to be as, like, conditioning, I guess you could say, as the Cantu product. That's why I'm putting it in second. And I mean, like, a hair mask in this. going to make my hair really soft and moisturized. Also, don't forget the inside, because a lot of people forget that. The hair on the inside of all your curls is like... So let's just comb that through. I really need a Denman brush at this point. Okay, we're gonna let this sit in there for a few more minutes, like five minutes or so. So this is when I was talking about putting product in my hair. So that's what we're gonna do. I meant wet, okay? Let me take out. First, we're going to use the Garnier leave-in conditioner. And, like, I don't even want a lot of product in my hair, so this will kind of help. And then we also have the Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curls, which is not horrible, but it is fine. Like, it's cool. I should probably make a part, but I can't see, so. Let me go ahead and put this hair oil in. Just kind of seal everything in even though my hair is wet and it's probably all falling out of my hair. Now we're gonna get our little hair towel, microfiber towel, whatever you have. Alright guys, my camera died, but I just put the towel on my head and I'm out of the shower now. I'm just gonna go ahead and like moisturize, put on deodorant, put on clothes, all that type of stuff. And then we're gonna take this towel out of my head and finish up the process. This is what my hair looks like. It's been like an hour and a half. Like this is why I put the towel on my head after because it dries my hair a lot and usually my hair would take like a whole day to dry but it's already pretty much dry. The roots are a little wet but like look at these curls. There's no crunch whatsoever. There's like a good hold but there's no crunch. Guys, this is my natural hair without a twist out. I'm using my brother's broken pick. He has so much hair. Well, yeah, guys, I guess we have come to the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I definitely recommend the hair care routine I did in this video. This wasn't a tutorial because I was just testing it out, but it actually turned out good. All the products I got are from Walmart, except for the Aussie deep conditioner. 
but I don't really think you need that. You can just get the regular Aussie Moist. Anyways, we have come to the end of this video, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, I know I did, like, you guys really convinced me to wear my natural curls. But yeah, if you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! I don't think they understand importance Popping the pool with my left hand Got my right hand on your golly She rolling off to the side, side, side Why she up to fucking Ali? I would fuck your body, Sally Popping up and now it's Sally Sipping, driving, got me swabbing